Ladies and gents, Sinistra No One, your host, and we're back with more Mass Effect Andromeda. We went around here, we've explored all the area around here that we can. It is time to get out our nomad and start exploring the rest of the world. Hopefully you all are enjoying the walkthrough. Right. All right, so what we're going to do is set up a different See if there's anything on here for this. As you can see, there's all kinds of little things that we can do. The Nomad should handle pretty smooth. Check both forward and reverse, would you? Mining computer. Oh, that's cool. Radiation levels increasing. Ugh, can't get traction. It's too steep. Switch to six wheel drive. It'll get you up there in a snap. Remember the Nomad's jump jets. They'll get you over most obstacles. If you need more juice, the boosters can accelerate you out of trouble. Got it. Signal's coming from that structure up ahead. So this is one of his memories, it looks like. Memory trigger. Another eidetic trigger, Sam? Yes. Though my memory array remains locked, additional triggers are required. Radiation within safe levels. From above us. There, look, up near that scaffolding. Changing positions. It's working, but I'm just getting random symbols. Glyphs. With more glyphs to expand my database from Habitat 7, I could interface fully with the console. And hopefully start up whatever helps the atmosphere. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Alright, so that is part of the main story, like I said, but we're not going for that just yet, but I just wanted to show you. So we will be coming back here in a little bit. But again, for now, we're going to stick with our main objective that I've got going on right now. Just finding these memories. When they sent the first colonists down here, everyone was so excited. After all the shit the Nexus had been through, we finally had something to believe in. Then the reports came back. This time will be different. Yeah, I'm more than ready to believe again. Pathfinder, 
There is Nexus equipment nearby. The person who left is behind. She was part of the first wave of colonists, wasn't she? The probability is high. This researcher may have left data pads at other remnant sites as well. Yet I'm going to be searching a lot of stuff. It's just one big ass world, I tell you. Lots to discover here. Eventually, we're going to need to go that way. Enemies! Sure, if you call them that. So, what's this? Loot from our outposts. And an Ark escape pod? Where did they get that? Hostiles ahead! Matter. They're not keeping it. We need an up close scan. So because of life support, we need to keep continually going in here. found it drifting and brought it here. I'm not able to extrapolate the point of origin, Pathfinder. The Ark might have... Loot from our outposts. And an Ark escape pod? Where did they get that? Crap. Do you think they might have found an Ark? We need an up-close scan. Wonder if there's anything hidden away back here. These caves could be a good shelter, if people need it. Watching the corners. Oh, the Nikeron. Solarian. Tyrant, he 
are alive and hope. Olar, in need of... of assistance. <laughs> a field log, Pathfinder. Issued to patrolling Ket. I don't need a translation to know when I'm hearing a monster. Adding to language database. Alright, so we can't go any further in there, because there's an area over there that will just destroy us very quickly. You gotta stay in the hazarded level, which is low, which is like around 1 or so. So, we're gonna bring up another mission. We can't do that one just yet. We're gonna head for this one. Sloppy in that last fight. Nasira would be scolding me for bad technique. She taught you just fine. You don't need hand holding. Just wish I felt steadier out here. All these new challenges. We're making it through. Sometimes that's all you need. Oops. <laughs> Depending on where this is. Scourge. Might be dangerous, but we should check it out. Okay, let's get in here a little bit. Radiation levels within acceptable limits. This will get our life support back up. Life support is stable. All right, so now we're at site two. Wonder why it won't let me scan that if, if it's telling me I can. Resilience. It was sold as the one we get right, but it didn't have time to get worn down. Got wiped out by cat. We'll deal with the cat, one thing at a time. Is anything? Looks like we can't search inside. There's a whole facility down there too. Detecting above normal radiation levels. Radiation within safe levels. Portable cover of cat design. Didn't bother to take it with. You can just see how big these didn't even finish unpacking areas are. Chance. Nothing too much to check out here. Type of landing pad. Uh. 
Looks like a war zone. According to survivors, the kid attacked from all sides. It was a massacre. Nexus not send a retrieval team for the bodies? We knew some were lost, Ryder. We weren't told they were left. Wonder how many are out there. Too many. Lexi, update. Pathfinder, I have enough sensory data to reconstruct an image of the past. Maybe we can push the cat back. With what army? Can you even find the safety on your pistol? I'm just going through the options. Evacuate or die. Those are the options. Well, we know which one they chose. Alright, what else do we got to explore here? Another area down here. There's a door there. You'd think there'd be more bodies. Not that I'm complaining. Not a lot left behind for a massacre. Oh. What if they were removed? We know the Nexus didn't bother picking up the bodies. You don't think it could have been the cat? That's a bad thought. Well, that you would think that they would do that to study us, right? But it looks like we can't enter Override these areas. Works, but Sam, the door was sealed from the outside? Yes, Pathfinder. It appears lockdown was manual before the power restrictions. Why do that? It wouldn't keep anything out. It would keep something in. Secondary terminals. No access. Sam. If deployment is standard, Main access will be deeper in. Way too quiet. Looks like they left in a hurry. They evac'd during a cat attack. Most didn't make it. Pathfinder, a maintenance bulletin was issued at the time of shutdown. What does it say? Ron. Override, close it! Tempest, we have an unknown enemy. Evac the Pathfinder. Whoa, hold on. No go, Harper. We have to lay low. Kent are inbound to your location. Kent and that thing? Son of a... What thing? I didn't even see a thing. Look sharp. That thing is out there. And the Kent? Everything's grounded till they're gone. Okay, they're all over there. Holy shit.
runs all weird like. Speech, don't get close. That's what I'm talking about. He's above us. Oh. All right. Woo. This component was security tagged for site two. Looks like they had some sort of special project going. Let's find the rest. Schematics for special project Sigma. They were building something, but there are parts missing. This must be the project they were salvaging at site one. A way to fight the cat. We could finish it. Surprised the Nexus still wants an outpost on Eos. You know what they say. Third time's a charm. We'll make this right. Alright, we'll see how close this mission is. There's two other places. It's pretty far away. But that was a very, very intense fight. We're going to keep up with our little secret mission, or no, the other mission here that we got going on right now. That was a fun fight, though. Lexi, update records for Trinidus Gordanus. Consider it done, Pathfinder. All right, so let's go back into our journal. That's it for now. I heard the attack on resilience was bad, but damn. The initiative's not military. They weren't prepared for an ambush. I guess I already got it. Well, okay. So... Can't go into water in this thing. Just trying to figure out how to get over there. Radiation levels increasing. Radiation levels normal.
I read your dossier. Dossier, huh? Fancy. This is where Chief Reynolds died. Sandstorms would have buried the body long ago. I suggest scanning. Karkins. Pathfinder, there is an armor piece buried deep. A leg bracer. Scan indicates tissue and bone fragments clinging to it. DNA identified as Chief Reynolds. Indications suggest his body was torn to pieces. So the Chief became Karkin food. Circle of life can be gruesome. The remaining armor will be scattered, or perhaps brought to a nest. The chest piece and his Omni tool may explain his death. Then we keep searching and scanning. about road hazards. Interesting rocks are just as bad for the nomad. Water and weather. Nothing tougher in the long run. Pathfinder. The scan has picked up Chief Reynolds' chest piece, confirming single shot. Unable to determine weapon type, but entry point was at the back. Exit blast through the chest. By all accounts, Nilkum was in front of the Chief when he fired. So it wasn't his shot that killed him. The Chief's Omni tool might shed some light. Remember the early data on Eos back home? When everywhere was labeled. Picking up additional armor scraps. I believe it's a trail leading to a cave nearby. Could be where the nest is located. It's a carcan nest, all right. Fan out. Confirming initiative equipment, including Omni tool assigned to security chief Hiram Reynolds. If you power it up, I can exhume its data. Accessing data. The chief was scanning at the time of death. The scan picked up two shots. One, a standard initiative rifle report, which missed. The other from behind, a Ket pulse weapon. This proves Milken is innocent. He didn't shoot Reynolds. That's a relief. Good work. Pathfinder, there is also an audio recording. Go ahead and play it. No! Where's Nilkin? Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Son of a bitch. Confirming. Voice identified as suspect, Nilkin. So he did not kill the chief. But he meant to. Need another chat with the man. All right, so if we're going to complete... I mean, this, this, oh, I love it. Even the side missions aren't, like, boring. They're actually so this technology on Habitat pretty fun and unique. Messing with the planet? We don't have all the answers yet. Don't expect any from the Nexus. They got a few reports, then the cat showed up. No time to study weird tech. Probably best to focus on the people shooting at you. I guess that's it. There's not really anything to to mess with here. It's another one of these little sites. All right. Well, we're gonna go ahead and complete this uh, this side mission here. If we can, hopefully we can get out this way. Severe radiation alert, Pathfinder. Detect 
Detecting above normal radiation levels. As you can see, if you go into radiation level 3, you're going to die very, very quickly. Four giants. Reminds me like Stonehenge. It's weird to think that if we pull this off, everything we're looking at could change. I liked those pre-trip vision paintings of future Eos. Green fields, rivers, forests. Wonder what it'll really be like down the line. Fewer death storms would be nice. All right, looks like we're finally back on the path here. What the hell happened here? That's cool. That is actually really cool. I like the way that it does this. But it doesn't look like we can actually uh, get in. But I digress. We're getting off topic here. Let's go. Although that does look unique. Although I guess it's nothing we can actually look at. Oh, we are back. Safe levels. Nice. Life support restored. All right. So we're going to go back to the Nexus so we can finish up this mission for you guys. Ascent is go. Leaving at home. All clear. All right, so if we're going to... Got a minute? Oh, we can actually talk to our people now. Oh, man, they... they Oh, they give you so much to do here. But for right now, before we do that, before we dive into all of that, let's back out. Let's finish this up. So we'll pick that up in a little bit. Right now, we're going to continue. <laughs> I didn't even know that there was this whole area here to um, to do where the Nexus was in the last exploration video. Or so I would have came here and we would have explored that as well. All right, so let's land at the docking bay so we can um, start uh, finish up this first murder.
All right, so now we are back here. Pathfinder, do you have just a minute? Yes, I will get with you in just a little bit. Let me finish up this first. As we haven't really been to this section yet. So, I know I'm kind of going in weird ways here, but uh, remember the trial only lets you go to once you finish that, get to a certain part in the, the, the main mission. So, we're trying to, to get all of this other stuff um, there so I can bring, keep continue to bring you guys more and more videos before the actual game releases. I hear you went down to Eos. Did you find anything to help my case? You're a liar. The Chief's Omni-Tool recorded you over the body, admitting to killing him. What? Wait, that's not... What are you trying to pull? Sam, playback. Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Well, shit. Guess my fate is sealed. Except that your shot missed. A ket blast to the back killed Reynolds. Are you... Are you serious? I'm innocent? What a stroke of luck. The conviction will have to be overturned. The sentence thrown out. I'm going to Tam, and I might have a different opinion. You did try to cover it all up. Look, I'm sorry I lied, but if my shot missed, I'm innocent, plain and simple. We'll see about that. All right, speak with Tan. I've just been trying to always stay with the love option. Something I can help you with? Director, I checked out that murder. Nilkin didn't do it, but there's proof that he meant to. This is unfortunate. We're trying to give the people a sense of stability, leadership they think they can count on. And we're setting precedent for justice here in Andromeda. Now this, a convicted murderer who didn't commit the murder. I hear you. It sucks when things aren't black and white. Are they ever? <sighs> If we suppress the evidence and uphold the conviction, we're banishing a man for a crime he technically didn't commit. If we throw the conviction out, we're freeing a man who tried to take matters into his own hands, then covered it up. Your investigation complicated this. You should take responsibility for the outcome. Do we still exile him for murder? Ooh. Man, this is a tough decision. Okay, listen. We are the lure. We're the Pathfinder, okay? The law is so weird in, in some of these ways. Clearly, he is innocent. He is innocent. But he had the intent to murder. But I think in this day and age, with the way the Andromeda Galaxy is, how we're trying to build and not destroy, keep everyone together as much as possible... I want to ex exile him because his intent was to kill him, but the fact is he did not commit the murder. So I know there's going to be people that might have disagreed with me, but we are going to release him. It was crazy down there, life and death, but his shot didn't kill Reynolds. We have to let him go. You're a bottom line type of person. I hope we don't regret it. All right, so be it. He will do community service for his role in the chaos. But he's a free man. Well, at least we'll have this sordid business behind us. So this could go again both ways. Who knows? Hopefully, it's the right choice. Well, it doesn't matter if it's the right choice. It's the choice that we made. You got to stick with your guns, what you believe in. And I believe that the law is the law. And, of course, if we don't set a precedence for the law, then anyone can just start running amok. So... I don't know if we can talk to him again. Maybe talk to his wife. If he's still in there or not. Nope, he's gone already. But where did his wife go? She's gone too, it looks like. Alright, well that's going to be it for this video. Uh, this is um, 
a video kind of spanning a lot of things. In the next video, we're going to open up a new side mission that we got here that we started or that uh, we heard about when we were on the Tempest and some other fun things to do before we get on to that main mission of EOS. I know we're kind of going back and forth, but again, I'm following this to the T, trying to give you guys as much content as we can before the release, and then uh, we'll continue on with all the missions and stuff. This is a very thorough walkthrough with all side missions, so hopefully you guys enjoy, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out. Bitches!